Hey guys, welcome to Behind the Line. It's Friday, November 13th. A uh, little breaking news for you here. Oregon just issued a new lockdown. Uh, Governor Kay Brown just had a press conference uh, just before 1 p.m. this afternoon announcing a two-week freeze and implemented new measures to limit group activities in an effort to slow the spread of coronavirus. This freeze will be in effect from November 18th through December 2nd statewide. Um, the two-week freeze measures include limiting gatherings indoors and outdoors to no more than six people total and from no more than two households. They are limiting faith-based gatherings to a maximum of 25 people indoors or 50 people outdoors. Restaurants and bars will be takeout only. Gyms and fitness organizations will be closed. Indoor recreational facilities, museums, indoor entertainment activities, and indoor pools and sports courts will also be closed, along with outdoor recreational facilities, zoos, gardens, aquariums, outdoor entertainment activities, and outdoor pools. Grocery stores and pharmacies will be set to a maximum of 75% capacity along with retail stores and malls. They're urging businesses to work from home as much as possible. They're prohibiting indoor visiting and long-term care facilities. Uh, according to Governor Brown, the two-week freeze does not change current health and safety protocols for personal services such as barber shops, hair salons, and non-medical massage therapy as they can continue operating under previous guidance issued by the Oregon Health Authority. It does also not affect congregate homeless sheltering, outdoor recreation and sports, youth programs, child care, K-12 schools, K-12 sports currently allowed, current Division I and professional athletic exemptions, and higher education. Health officials said social gatherings have been driving the increase in coronavirus cases. And they're saying uh, additional cases may have been linked to Halloween parties, weddings, and birthday parties. Oregon, Washington, and California also issued travel advisories urging visitors entering their states or returning home from travel outside these states to self-quarantine for two weeks to, spread, uh, to slow the spread of the virus. And they're urging individuals limit their interactions to their immediate household. So, folks, here we go again. And uh, my guess is this is not just going to be for two weeks, and it's going to get more restrictive uh, at the end of this two weeks. And we've got Inslee coming to talk uh, to us Washingtonians early next week. I'm not sure what day, but uh, I would imagine the same sort of thing is coming for Washington as well. And we're not the only states in the country that have done this in the last day or two. So here we go again, folks. It's going to be a long two months to the end of the year. Anyway, that's it. Have a great day. Happy Friday the 13th.